In this video, I'm going to share five tips to help you make money with e-commerce and drop shipping. Make sure you stay until the very end where I share the most essential tip in creating massive amounts of money with your e-commerce store. This tip alone is a game changer. Also, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and click the bell because it really does help out the channel and I appreciate it. Tip number one, find the best niche. Exactly how do you identify a niche that is most likely going to generate income online? The answer is simple. Your business needs to satisfy these two requirements. First, it needs to be something you're interested in. And second, it needs to be something that enough other people are interested in too. Choose a drop shipping niche you're interested in. Generating income is necessary. However, this shouldn't be the sole reason you're starting this business. If it is, you won't have any relationship with the items being offered. It will also be more challenging to provide great customer support and create a brand you care about. So why exactly is having a passion and an interest in your product so crucial? Passion-driven business owners usually stand out in photography, branding, well-thought-out social media posts, and also in overall communication. If you would like your e-commerce store to truly succeed, dull advertisements will not suffice. If you are interested in and passionate about what you promote, an authentic connection with potential customers will be a lot easier to achieve. Choosing a drop shipping niche that other people are interested in. The next aspect of the formula is that your specific niche needs to be popular among other people. And at the very least, it should be popular enough to uphold an e-commerce business. If you love patio chairs, that's great. However, you may have a hard time getting a bunch of customers who have the same enthusiasm for outdoor patio furniture. So how can you discover a specific niche that other people will be interested in too? Typically, passion and hobby niche markets have more sales possibilities and regular customers. So consider leisure activities you care about and really enjoy that are likely to be popular among other people too. Do some investigation on social media sites or make use of Google Trends to find out if the subject you have an interest in is trending. Search for specific niches that are going to be the next new thing as opposed to niches that are already well established. Tip number two, create a powerful brand. In order to get the absolute most out of your dropshipping business, your brand must be more powerful than any particular item that you sell. Your task as a dropshipper is to sell your products by offering a much better branding experience than your competitors. And so, what creates excellent branding? Let's check out three essential characteristics your brand needs to have. Value, quality, and consistency. Brand value. Customers pick brands that resonate with them and their values. So highlight what is important to you and be crystal clear on what you represent. This could simply be in how you connect with others. Consider an e-commerce brand such as Dollar Shave Club. They convey their image and values with no nonsense videos and advertisements. And even its name reveals what they represent. Or you might demonstrate what's important to you by connecting your brand with specific charities. For instance, your brand might give 10% of all earnings to elephant shelters and other good causes. Brand quality. Accountability and trust are really important when it comes to e-commerce. If customers don't have confidence in your business, they'll just purchase somewhere else. And your business can do a lot to develop and maintain that trust. A good looking website, top notch logos and design, and an involved social media presence are all components that will allow potential customers to really feel like they can trust your business with their money. Brand consistency. Great brands are consistent throughout their communication, regardless of if it's on their social media platforms, their web page, or in their customer service. Famous brands like Harley Davidson, Lego, Nike, and Disney all do an incredible job of showing their brand image at every single point. Not only does this demonstrate attention to detail and professionalism, but it also makes connections with your business much more satisfying for buyers. So whether you're coming up with a Facebook advertisement, 
composing an FAQ, or improving a product page, always ask yourself, how would the brand say this? You can also do this with the items you choose to sell. Select products that have a very similar look and feel and quality as your brand. Find inspiration from brands you like. If you're just beginning, a great tip would be to add on to and improve the image of well-established rivals in your industry. For instance, if you're offering books, you can look at Barnes & Noble or comparable brands as a launching pad for your ideas. But make sure you don't just copy them. Only use these current brands as a motivation and be sure that your brand is top quality. You can even combine various aspects of multiple brands to make a totally different brand that's unique and memorable. And keep in mind, when creating a brand, every little thing counts, from the color scheme to the specific words and grammar used for product descriptions. The solid brand you create is going to be essential in allowing you to generate income online. It will help you to stand apart from the masses and transform random shoppers into regular customers. Tip number three, automate. Many dropshipping business owners work with a range of systems to automate as many reoccurring jobs as possible. This will allow your everyday business to operate much easier. Because of this, you'll have the time to work on the tasks that really make a difference, like choosing excellent products, establishing your brand, and connecting with your potential customers. So what can automation tools do for you? A, processing orders. Automation resources can instantly synchronize your supplier's inventory feeds with your e-commerce store and let you process orders at the simple click of a button. B, converting customers. You can use automation tools for sales also. There are apps providing automation SMS, email and push notification messages. These are sent out automatically to consumers in a range of circumstances, including when they have deserted a shopping cart or haven't purchased something for a significant period of time. C, customer support. Another wonderful approach to running your business more smoothly is to improve your customer service with chatbots. With the help of AI, these virtual assistants can respond to almost all basic questions, only if they aren't too complicated. This boosts your response time and deals with daily support concerns, keeping you free to concentrate on the questions that are most detailed or significant. Just keep in mind, you don't want to get too extreme with this. The main aspects and tasks of your store should continue to be managed by you. Your customers won't like a business that appears to be operated by a robot. Tip number four, go to e-commerce events. Attending seminars and mingling with other business owners may feel like a waste of time and a waste of money. You might be thinking you should just devote yourself completely to developing a strong online e-commerce store and focus on socializing later. However, attending e-commerce events is a smart idea. So what will you receive from these events? A. You'll learn a lot from other prosperous online businesses. At the events, you can learn directly from prosperous entrepreneurs with significant experience and expertise in the dropshipping field. You don't have to reinvent the wheel. All you have to do is learn from people who've already done it before you. B. Say goodbye to guessing. Rather than investing months or years using trial and error to find out what you really need to do, you can talk to service providers or platform technicians one-on-one. -on -one. You'll receive a clear-cut knowledge of how various technologies function and what their advantages are. Chatting with someone face-to-face -face makes it a lot easier to deal with your potential worries and select a management system or platform that's ideal for your needs. C. You'll get motivated. We all get a little discouraged from time to time. An event is a great way to get new ideas and boost your innovative thinking. Listening to motivating success stories and finding out the most recent technologies will certainly get you excited about the future of your online business. D. You'll get direct access to wholesalers. Industry functions will offer you immediate access to a variety of retailers and trusted wholesalers that might have an interest in your proposal later on. 
If you're really looking to make more money with your dropshipping business, going to an e-commerce event is a wise investment of your time and money. You'll get the most up-to-date knowledge and save yourself loads of time down the road. Before I move on to one of the most important tips, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and click the bell because it really does help out the channel and I appreciate it. Also type the word yes in the comments below if you're wanting to make money with a drop shipping business. Number five, provide incredible customer service. In order to be prosperous and earn money, you'll have to have outstanding customer service. This is particularly essential for new businesses. One study revealed that buyers are more likely to speak about an e-commerce business if they have a very bad or very good experience. This indicates that you need your customer service to do two main things. A. Make sure that there aren't any bad customer experiences that could result in complaints and B, provide a genuinely outstanding service that people will talk about. Great customer service is an obvious way that you can add great value as a dropshipper. Here are a few suggestions to follow. A, make customers feel like you really know them. Make sure to use their names and their favored methods of communication. Little touches like this can go a long way. B, being honest is always the best. It can require 12 good customer experiences to offset just one negative experience. It's always much better to under-promise and then over-deliver. So be crystal clear on what you can and cannot do for your buyers. C. Don't take too long with responses to questions. Taking forever to respond is one of the biggest problems buyers have. So show your support hours in a noticeable area of your dropshipping store and feature them in your automated email responses. This will allow you to establish realistic expectations. Then be sure you have the ability to meet those expectations. D. Offer a straightforward and helpful FAQ section. Let your customers know every detail about your product. An FAQ section will guarantee a better customer experience and can considerably reduce the amount of questions. There's one last thing to remember when it comes to customer service. If you intend to regularly earn money in the dropshipping business, you need to learn from the customers. If you can pay attention to what they're saying, regardless of whether it's positive or negative, then the better you'll be able to select successful products and develop your store. And in addition to that, people will appreciate the fact that you're making the effort to listen. If you want a step-by-step -step guide on how to start dropshipping on Shopify for beginners, then click the video on the screen. Here I'll share the exact steps you can take to launch a successful dropshipping business if you're just starting out.